This might look like a normal 2D video, but it's not. It's actually over 300,000 still images of me combined to make 60 3D models every single second. Talk to it to Ipswich in the UK countryside is one of the coolest companies on earth. Its name is Infinite Realities, and they have one of the most powerful camera rigs outside of companies like Meta. I came across their work in mid-2022 when they were working on modifying NVIDIA's instant nerf to create some of the most lifelike 3D reconstructions of people. Since that moment, it became a dream of mine to one day be captured, but I never imagined it would only take me a year and a half. In late 2024, I received an invitation to go to the UK to moderate a panel with one of the authors of Gaussian Splatting, and I eagerly accepted. Infinite Realities has a heavily modified and licensed version of Gaussian Splatting, but what is Gaussian Splatting? Gaussian Splatting is a radiance field representation that can reconstruct lifelike 3D from a series of normal 2D images or video. However, Infinite Realities setup is special. In addition to being able to freeze a moment in time, they can also reconstruct 4D video. How could I see this and not want to go? Stepping into infinite realities was one of the craziest experiences of my life. I was surrounded by hundreds of cameras, lights, rigs, and the calm hum of GPUs running in the distance. For the first few hours, Lee and Henry took me through several demos and reconstructions they had made, both in VR and through their computers. I had never seen reconstruction fidelity as high as theirs and got lost in it. It was easy to almost forget why I had traveled to see them in the first place, with how much there was to see. But soon we turned towards the main camera rig. It's like a photograph from every angle. Until you're faced with literal hundreds of cameras and lights, it's hard to describe the potentially overwhelming feeling of being recorded from all angles simultaneously. Sun position, so it's bright, constant, so it's got like a hard shadow. Right. <laughs> yeah. So that's, that's the speed. It's like 64 different light states. That's insane. So that's 64 <laughs> different colored splats, basically. Right. While Henry was preparing the rig, I went over my lines in my head, fully aware that every second that I wasted was equivalent to roughly 130 gigabytes of pure data. Although the camera rig itself was incredibly complex, Henry had it up and running within a minute and we were ready to finally begin filming. Knowing that in the 30 seconds of recording, more images were taken of me than the entirety of my lifetime combined was humbling, but it also made me excited for the future. With that, the lights came on and we were ready to go. My name is Michael Rubloff from RadianceFields.com and today I'm at Infinite Realities in Ipswich to show the current state of the art in Radiance Field based technologies like Gaussian Splatting. This might look like a video, but it's actually a fully dynamic Radiance Field, meaning that we can go absolutely anywhere. Radiance Fields can create hyperreal 3D, so imagine when stories, memories, and other captures become possible when photography and videos leave 2D. Over the next couple of years, we're going to see the most incredible stories come to life in 3D, and in this case, 4D. Also, Gaussian Splatting is a Radiance Field. We want people to have the same experience, so we've released the entire capture as a VR experience through Unity for free. You could download the package from the link in the video description. We also want to encourage people to try out the various Radiance Field pipelines like Gaussian Splatting, so we've also open sourced the data. Yes, all 300,000 images. In addition, we've also open sourced all of the 2,000 trained POI files in case people don't have access to the hardware necessary to train the data. Thank you so much to both Lee and Henry for letting me come to Infinite Realities. If you'd like to learn more about Infinite Realities, there's also a link in the video description.